Okay, we've got W510 here, the Acer W510 Intel Clovertrail tablet running Windows 8. Um, now, I'm a big fan of uh, portrait mode in small uh, tablet sizes. This is a 10 inch, but it's uh, 16 by 9, so actually the width of the tablet is not too bad, and there is a good possibility for uh, thumb typing down here without having to use the split keyboard, which I also find which I actually find quite stressful in terms of eye movement. So when you can get to a standard keyboard and get to the point where your thumbs can cross over in the middle, you've got a good possibility to do some typing in portrait mode. So let me just do you a, a quick uh, demo here. I'll talk it through and highlight any mistakes that are coming up on the screen. I hope you can read it. I've done this in 4.3 mode so that it actually fits on a bit better. So uh, let's go. This is a test of the portrait mode text input in Windows 8. Right, um, one error in there. This is a TED of the portrait mode test input in Windows 8. Okay, not perfect. Let's carry on. I'm a... Actually, I don't think autocorrection is happening here. That's interesting. All right. That's, that's interesting, because if we come out of that, and we go to, let's go to the mail application, which has autocorrection. Right then, I'm going to, um, let's select this and delete this. Whoops. Select all, delete. Right, let's try and type this. This is a test of the text input um, on uh, Windows 8 with the Ace uh, w, whoops, W510. Okay, this is a test of the text Imut on Windows 8 with the Acer 510. So a couple of errors in there. I am at a slight angle here, so I'm not totally 100% uh, perfect. Uh, I am a big fan of light weight and uh, slim tablets for portrait mode thumbing input. Let's read that through. I'm a big fan of lightweight and slim tablets for portrait ode rumming input. So a couple of errors there, but you can click on those and okay. Some of the errors there are oh, oh, um, giving correct auto correction or possible corrections that are not. Right. The Acer Whoops, made a mistake there. The in capitals Ace uh, W510 is a lightweight Windows 8 tablet running on Clover Trail at under. 500 gram it means you can type in uh, portrait mode with very little strain on the wrist right let's read that the acer w510 is a lightweight okay there's an error there let's correct that windows 8 tablet running on clover trail at under 500 grams it means you can type in nori okay so we need to uh, correct that in whoops it hello let's move that in space portrait i think auto correct that portrait mode with very little strain on the wrist so there's only a couple of errors in that which is actually pretty good um Let's carry on. The quick brown fox jumped over the lazy dog. And note that I've only been using this for three days. That was perfect. The quick brown fox jumped over the lazy You can hear some auto corrections going on in the background. It does this extra click. Um, the quick brown fox jump whoops over the lazy dog. So it's pretty good at auto correcting. All three of those were correct. I forgot um 
full uh, stop on that one. Sorry, I need to move away from the screen a bit. Okay. Peter Piper picked a piece of pickled pepper that is needing a some corrections. Peter Piper picked a okay. That's correct. Um, so far, I'm impressed with the the W510, and I believe that Windows 8 could work, comma, with Clover Trail in. 8.9 inch format mat, which would make typing even easier. Let's read that back. So far I'm impressed with W85 and I believe, let's just put, take the space out, that Windows 8 could work with Clover Trail. That's a, it's a correction there. I don't like the way it selects the whole thing. Clover Trail in 8.9 inch format, which would, let's see if that, yep, also correct, make typing even easier. So, only a couple of mistakes in that. I'm sorry I can't uh, zoom in uh, perfectly so you can actually read. There's the text, I'm just going to hold it there for a few seconds so you can read the mistakes. Here are um, the words it doesn't uh, remember, so I can put that in the in the word book, a dictionary. Um, auto correction here, input, actually, I think I'm in, no, I'm in. There's an auto correction here, I believe. There you go. And is that going to correct? That's going even going to correct to the new word I put in the dictionary. So very good. Um, so yeah, just really wanted to just demonstrate that portrait mode typing, thumbing on a 10-inch tablet when it's 600 grams or less, is um, an interesting experience on, on Windows 8 and something that I'm actually really quite pleased with. The weight of this W510 means that you can do it. I'm not sure if it would work on. Um, a 12.5 inch screen, in fact I'm pretty sure it wouldn't, it would be heavier and much wider, uh, but 10 inch and under it works pretty well. Uh, it's not perfect, actually I would say the perfect size would be an 8.9 inch 16.9 screen, it would be lighter, you'd get more of a crossover with your thumbs, um, and, and it would be have, have good hit areas for your, your thumbs as well. 7 inch could be actually a 7 inch is great, I've used that for a couple of years, but um, I think 8.9 inch could be optimal, and I think that's possible with Clover Trail. Sorry for the messy kind of demo and the messy background, I'm in the studio here, I just wanted to demo that, and um, you'll find cleaner videos of the W510 on my channel, so check it out. My name's Chippy, UMPC Portal is where I'm reporting on the uh, Clover Trail tablets right now. Thanks for watching.